Most of us drive somewhere every day. You and I, we see other cars pass by all the time. But a team in Forsyth County is looking a little closer. They want to bust drug and human traffickers. It is called the I team or interdiction team. And many of people like you have questions about how it works. WFMY News 2's Jansen Silvers is digging deeper to find answers. Well, you have questions about this I team and we wanted to do our best to answer them. Tim Free says borderline entrapment, but what is it exactly? We went to someone who knows the law for the answer. Entrapment is more of a situation where a person is put in a situation where they break the law and they otherwise would not have done that, but for law enforcement putting them in that position. That's Jones Bird, a lawyer at Crumpler, Friedman, Parker and Witt, and he says no, it's not entrapment, but there does have to be some reason to pull someone over. However, it doesn't have to be much. It can really be as simple as just leaving your lane. So if they're on the side of the road, they can't just stop anybody that comes by just on a whim. It's got to be more than that. They've got to have reasonable and articulable suspicion that some criminal activity is afoot. And then another viewer, CK Lanning, says, quote, false. They are just trying to generate revenue by ticketing people. I spoke with the sheriff's office and they said it can be a good way to bring in money because if you seize any of that drug money, they are able to repurpose it. But let's be clear. The I team's purpose is stopping drugs and people from being trafficked, not.